For this art talk, I plan to do drawing then painting because that's the two art making activities that I love the most. However, I realized my paints will not be sufficient enough for the entire drawing. So instead of using paints, I did mosaic art using the old magazines I found at home. The first thing that I did was of course to draw. Here, I draw something that would best reflect my thoughts of what makes an artist a good artist. The second thing that I did was to look for pages with the colors that I need for my mosaic art and cut them to smaller pieces of squares and rectangles. So going back, since I was young, I thought that being a good artist means knowing many ways or forms of making art. So I tried to involve myself in many forms of art making, such as drawing, painting, dancing, acting in school, and even poem writing. The third thing that I did was to do the mosaic art by pasting the paper cuts of the same color together to fill my drawing with colors. So I tried many forms of art making and because of that I can say that I really never mastered one which made me doubt myself if I am really a good artist because only few appreciates my art. So if you're like me who also doubted themselves, it's okay because what makes an artist a good artist is not about others' opinion about their art. It's their ability to freely and effectively communicate and express their thoughts and emotions through their work of art. And for me, it is drawing that allowed me to freely and effectively express my thoughts, my ideas, and myself, which my mouth can say. And just remember that art is subjective. What is beautiful for you might not be beautiful for others and vice versa. So others not appreciating your art is okay. And that does not mean that your art is bad or that you are not good enough or you're not a good artist.